to Mochi's Mochi Style Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I want to show you guys how to take the Dollar Tree acrylic containers and turn them into beautiful acrylic boxes that you can use for storage all around your home. So if you want to see how I created this beautiful acrylic boxes here, just keep watching. So here are the items that you need for this DIY. You need a medium size storage container, a small size container, and a three compartment acrylic container here, also from the Dollar Tree. And I'm using my gold Rust-Oleum spray paint with a paint pen. You can also purchase something similar from the Dollar Tree here. And I'm also using this cabinet nub that I already have. You need some hinges and some box corners. I already have this, but you can purchase it online or you can go to Home Depot to get this. I'm also using my E6000 along with my super glue. So I went ahead and spray painted the top cover of the medium and the small containers here with my gold spray paint. So next we're going to just go ahead and attach our hinges to our boxes. So this is for the medium and the small. So I'm using my super glue to do this. So all I'm doing here is just applying my super glue to the hinge and I'm going to place that right on the back of my box. So this is for the small in the medium box. So I repeated the same steps for the medium box, attached my hinges to the back of the box. All you do is just again apply your super glue to it and put it onto the back of your box and apply pressure to it to secure it into place. Next we're going to be attaching our knobs onto our boxes. So all I did with this is apply my E6000 along with a little bit of super glue just to help hold it in place while the E6000 dries. So I did that for the small and the medium box here. And next I'm using my paint pen to outline the bigger container here. So it's very easy to do. I'm using the side of the paint pen to deposit the paint onto the sides where I want to outline. So next I'm going to go ahead and just outline the inside of the top cover and I'm only doing this for the top cover. So all you do is just take your paint pen and outline the inside of the top cover. For the bottom base I'm going to be lining it with the inserts that I cut out from a gift bag. So here it is. It's just placed that right on the inside. Next, I'm attaching my hinges to the back of my bigger container here. We're repeating the same steps that we did for the small and the medium box. And I also put some painter's tape on the back just to kind of hold it in place while it dries. Next, I'm attaching my box corner onto the corners of all four sides of the box. And here is the box here. It's very easy to open with the hinges in the back. Here is the final result of my DIY here. I think they all turned out really, really pretty. It really goes well with my style. Here is the bigger box here. I'm storing my sunglasses, some pen, and my watch in here. This is going to go into my office. I just want to use it kind of like as a display box. And here are the other two boxes here. I think this turned out really, really pretty. You can store your jewelry in it. You can store... Um, your makeup in it the possibilities here are endless i hope you guys enjoyed this diy if you did please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and if you're new to our channel please go ahead and hit that subscribe button let me know in the comments down below which one you like the most and let me know what you would store in there thanks again for watching and i'll see you guys next time take care bye bye